A total of 93.58% of students have passed in this year SSC and its equivalent exams. The government is working to build a state of the modern Air Force, said Prime Minister. BNP's decision not to enter into dialogue with the president is the bad news for democracy, said Ubaidul Qadir. Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Farhan Yasmin within the newsroom today watching your lines. Now the details. A total of 93.58% of students have passed in this year secondary school certificate SSC and its equivalent examinations. The results were published at 10.45 a.m. on Thursday. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina published the result virtually after inaugurating the free textbook distribution program at Bongobondhu International Conference Center in the capital. Prime Minister called upon the new generation to develop as timely and efficient people. She urged to ensure vaccine for all if corona outbreak is under control. This year, 22,78,098 students and 11,55,096 boys and 11,23,002 girls took part in the SSC and its equivalent examination from 29,035 institutes under 11 education boards in the country. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has said that the government is working to build a state of the modern Air Force. The Prime Minister directed the members of the Air Force to be always ready for any sacrifice in the service of the motherland. She said this while participating in the parade of the Winter President of Bangladesh Air Force at Joshua Air Force Academy. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina called upon every member of the armed forces to make every fall to protect the country's airspace as well as to build the country. Awami League General Secretary Badal Qadir has termed the decision of BNP not to enter into dialogue with the president as a bad news for the country's democracy. He said that in the end, the BNP will take part in the next election. Their main plan is to question the election and the commission in the name of participating in the election. Badal Qadir said this while participating in a meeting of the leader in charge of Awami League on the conduct of Narangon city elections. Oxford AstraZeneca booster dose vaccine is given in the capital's Nakangola Institute, however, as a third dose. Many were expecting Pfizer or a Moderna vaccine. So people did not bring the vaccine card even after receiving the message. As a result, they have suffered a beat. Unlike the first and the second doses, the booster dose is also of interest in the people, said the director of the institute, Professor Dr. Abu Hanif. He also said until the safety apps are updated, the booster dose activities will continue with the predominance of the 60s. The election of the Executive Committee of the Bangladesh Crime Reporter Association, CRAB, has ended in a festive atmosphere in the capital, Shegun Bagicha. Voting took place at the CRAB office from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Candidates and voters came to the CRAB office since morning. After that, voting started in an orderly and joyous atmosphere from the scheduled time. Through this vote, the voters will elect the leadership of the disorganization of crime journalists for the next one year. We are about to the end headlines once again. A total of 93.58% of students have passed in this year SSC and its equivalent exams. The government is working to build a state of the modern Air Force, said Prime Minister. BNP's decision not to enter into dialogue with the president is a bad news for democracy, said Badal Qadir. 
Six terrorists, including two Pakistan nationals, have been killed in Jammu and Kashmir. ICC announced the four nominees for the Men's Audio Player of the Year Award. Thanks for being with us. To join with MyTV News Online, visit YouTube slash MyTV News. To watch all our program, visit YouTube slash MyTV Bangla, Facebook slash MyTV Bangla. Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz.